I'm changing my uh, categories. Hold on. Will didn't delete my save. Shut up. See? I didn't read the dono. I couldn't read it. I want to say you've really been an asshole lately. Just had to get it off my chest. Wait, why? <coughs> why, Shy Luna Moon? I cannot believe you fell asleep so fast. <laughs> How dare you? No, I don't think she's debating me. I think she's honest. The day with me. And Blade Runner is a pretty dreamy movie to watch at night. Wait, is it because I, I said I'd eat fish? Is replicant? If push came the shelf? Sorry, I can see you're not wide awake like me. No, I'm sorry I crashed so hard. Were you okay? You have been continuous have the same amount of asshole I think the past three months. Me. You are a bitch in the morning. Pro bullying, What's yes, pro animal cruelty. Okay, I'm not pro bullying, okay? And I'm not pro animal cruelty either. Jesus fucking Yesterday Christ. Was such a blast. It was great seeing you. I know things were different when we were just dorky kids, but being with you made me feel like when we were little pirates jumping and running through the forests again. It meant a lot to me just to chill out with you and, and bullshit. Fuck. Um, I'm getting my regular head pains. Uh, can you pretty please go upstairs and get my my Telling people to shut up a lot lately. You just been rude with your comment. It's uh, it's total Star Trek shit. You can't even see the needle. Seriously, I, I need it. Um, Hold on. All right, I'll change my place in the. Telling people to shut up a lot lately. Okay. Um. Yeah, I don't know. I'm sure they fucking deserve it, Shy Luna Moon. Shy Luna Moon is not a fucking troll. Hello, Chloe. She likes fluffy animals now. I meant you tell the trolls now to shut up instead of taking the bait. Okay, wait, hold on. I gotta change this again. I'm gonna fucking lose my mind, dude. Here, is this good? Is this better? Sorry, just being honest. You're more. It's more than usual. I don't know what you mean by that. Honestly, I'm sorry. You're quiet compared to the game audio level. Okay, I'll lower the... <sighs> Man, I can't please everyone. Uh, is tone policing? No. Wait, where the fuck do I normally put this? I think I put it over here. Sounds like an Esteban fan projecting you've been good, lol. No. No. Shy, Shy Luna Moon is not a fucking Destiny fan at all. Okay, all right, let's get going. Talk about chaos theory. I fucked everything. Oh my God, I made that mix for her when we were 12. I'm not gonna go, I'm not gonna go yet. That's a serious heat lamp. I hope you're not jealous of all my tech toys. Does Chloe look at the garden and think about her childhood? I'm not she reading your chat, Leftist the Lemon. Chill the fuck out. Despite everything, 
It's cool that in this reality, Chloe really loves skating too. This game doesn't suck at all, by the way. I was so wrong. It's actually a lot of fun. And wow, sir. Chloe was a straight A student. She could have gone to any college. What a bastard. I totally should have let Chloe steal your bullshit fund, even if it wasn't another reality. Given that the campus in our school has not yet undergone the modern renovation seem necessary to fulfill all the needs of your daughter? What the fuck? The handicap fund, dude. The fucking handicap fund. It was a lie. I can't believe I, I can't believe I got mad at her. Here, camp placement is no longer scuffed. At least Chloe doesn't weigh that much. I'm not jealous of all my tech toys. I'm blown away, Tony Stark. Oh man, she has to use that ventilator just to breathe. Yo, she's still hot as fuck, dude. Sorry, not sorry. Yeah, I said it. That must be her mighty morphine machine. No more bongs, nothing but medical supplies. I don't know why we're not hooking up right now, is the real question. She has to use a lot of lotion to keep her blood circulating. She's not fucking 15. She's 18. Shut the fuck up. Whoa. Chloe can totally control her computer. It's so great people get this high-tech help. I should offer to put makeup on for Chloe. Not that I can, but it would be fun. I still can't believe I put Chloe in that chair. I checked all this shit last night. I'm doing it again for all the people who are watching. Bonjour. That's great they finally went to Paris. Damn. This is just for Chloe's basic supplies. No, I don't think Joyce's tips will cover all this. They gave Chloe their giant expensive HDTV, and they use her shitty tube television. To think that our destiny is linked to goddamn car keys. I look away from the chat after I say some shit about how she's 18, and then I turn around. A minute later, you guys are still making the same jokes. Like, you should be embarrassed of yourself, dude. You should be embarrassed of yourself. You're, you guys are still making age jokes. Like. Jesus Christ. These whales are just a preview of the tornado to come. And the Prescott Foundation? 
Rachel Amber is even missing in this reality. I guess I can't change everything. Ooh, Everybody knows she's a five she's a five thousand year old dragon, okay? Hey William. Um am I bothering you? Why yes, Max, I love going through bills. <laughs> Kidding. How can you bother me? I haven't seen you in forever. I know. You look exactly the same. <laughs> it's so cool. Good. Or I'd be scared if I didn't look like me. <laughs> of course, you seem more adult now. So what's on your mind? So you finally made it to Paris. Oui, as they say. <laughs> Not me, because I can't speak French. But it was a great experience. I said Especially this yesterday. I should have let this dad I die. I loving it there. You guys rock for going on a family adventure like that. She talked about going to school there. But that's not practical anymore. It's not fair, Max. He just fucking sucks. Like, he just sucks. Being His jokes are so bad. Is so nostalgic. Very old school, as they say. <laughs> I think it's great for Chloe to see you. Makes Joyce happy, too. So, it's not all bad news in Arcadia Bay. It wasn't the car accident. It was just jokes that paralyzed her, dude. The Prescott family might be bad news. What do you think about them? Evil. Next question. Sounds like you know them well. More than I want to. But we, we, to as I would say if I was French. I don't even like to think about it. What do you think is going on with all of this crazy weather and animals dying? Nobody knows, right? It is Nostradamus type shit, pardon my French. But all I actually care about now is Chloe and Joyce. My family. I was reading about that missing girl, Rachel Amber. He said oh, part yeah, of my friend. She went to Blackwell, right? That's oh, disgusting. Perfect. That's a real nightmare for a family. I get scared thinking about Chloe and that we might lose her someday. Huh. Bernie Sanders offers... Bernie Sanders wants Medicare for all for all Americans. Except some of his organizers actually got sick. What do you say to that, liberals? Guess what? He's owned. Sorry, I was... I was impressed by Chloe's room and all the high-tech equipment. You should be. We could buy a few mansions for what it all costs. The insurance helps, but uh, I don't know, Max. I know it must be hard on you guys financially. Good one. His bills right? are more like crushing. We have to mortgage our home, and that's pretty scary. But but we'll get through it. Look at the reality of, right. of not having socialized medicine. No? Why don't you go back in time and fucking get Bernie Sanders to? run for president beforehand maybe in, in by 20 fucking 2020 we'd have like actual medicare for all i don't know how to say this but i'm truly sorry about what happened to chloe me too all it takes is a few minutes to change a girl's whole life but she's alive she's been a trooper Is she mad at me for not staying in touch? She should be. I have no excuse. She was disappointed, but she knows you care. And I know how hard it is to process all this. It's taken us years. William, I just want you to know that whatever happens, I'll always be here for Chloe. Always. I know you will, Max. I have to go see if Chloe needs anything. It was so great talking with you again. You act like it's the last time. And please, keep me from oh these my bills God. whenever you want. We're 100% going back in time to kill this dude, okay? Like... No change to spare anymore. Now it's back to cookies. Like 100%. So... That's Choices why That's why she's being bars. ominous, dude. That's why she's like, oh yeah. No matter what happens, like, I love you, Mr. William. Like... Just kidding. I'm going to fucking murder you, Mr. William. So.
Wait, is the audio gone? What the fuck? God damn it, left this lemon, you fucking son of a bitch. Oh, Max, it is so nice to have you around. Look at them. They have no idea what's in their future. William is trying so hard. He's still awesome. Yeah, so hard. He's gonna die for being for making bad dad jokes. That is such a sweet shot of Chloe. I wonder who took the picture. Oh no. I didn't realize how bad Chloe's entry really was. I'm committed to her well being, but I want you to understand the reality. God damn it, I gotta save Chloe, dude. Good morning, Max. Oh, you and Chloe are so much quieter now than when you were kids. I remember. It's nice waking up in your house again. I can't believe I did this. William and I love it. Finally seeing you and Chloe together after all these years. After the accident. How are you doing, Joyce? I'm doing the best I, did I can, this. Max. I won't lie. It's difficult, but... Nobody said life was easy here in Arcadia Bay. Do you know somebody named David Madsen? He, um, might hang out at the two wheels. Well, that was random. Yeah, he's a, a bus driver. He comes in sometimes. Cute, quiet. Why? Oh, um, I, w I was just curious. You always were. Nice to see that everything doesn't change. Plus, you guys have to work, too. Ah, uh, Bill and I have no time for ourselves. We're working more than we're living. I even had to take a part-time gig at Pan Estates. Ugh. Do you know the Prescotts? I know that Sean Prescott won't be happy until he owns everything in Arcadia Bay. Stay away from his son, Nathan. So, what do you think is going on here with all of this eco-havoc? Maybe Arcadia Bay just wants to be left alone. I know the feeling. Honestly, I don't give a shit about too much outside our house. I don't blame you, Joyce. Except now we have dead birds and beach whales outside our front door. So maybe I should care, for Chloe's sake. I wish I was a better friend. I know Chloe doesn't get many visitors. Oh, Max, you're Chloe's best friend for a reason. You're here exactly when she needs you. Who helps Chloe out when you guys are at work? We have a series of revolving nurses and caretakers. <laughs> Chloe still causes trouble, even if she can't move. Max, Chloe's condition is not improving. Her respiratory system is very weak, and she... She... Do you know what I'm saying? I can't believe I did it. Oh, okay, we gotta save her. Come on! I'm so sorry you have to go through all this. Bad or good, I embrace every moment with my daughter and my husband. I'm gonna go this back in time and to be a family. I'm gonna go back and in time and bring Chloe to Cuba, where healthcare no is superior what. to the United States. I have to tell you how much I love seeing you and William together again. He's been such a hero through all this. Chloe and I. Lucky to have him. Chloe and William seem like they still get along so good. Yeah, those two are closer now more than ever. Chloe will actually listen to William while she usually ignores me. Oh, it's so cute when they gang up on poor old me. You rule, Joyce. Shit. Things would be different if I did. I like how you think, kid. I better get back to Chloe now. It's good talking with you, Joyce. You too, honey. I could take her to Canada too, Black Sheep Aries. You right. I love Canada. What the fuck do you mean? Some of my favorite people are Canadian, okay? Apparently the only thing that hasn't changed is this view. 
Wait, why did everyone think Jordan Peterson? <laughs> I met a son Avi the other day. Canada is 12, man. <laughs> Iman is Canadian, guys. XUC is Canadian. The bathroom looks almost the same. Just more medicine. Justin Bieber is Canadian. Here it is. I never thought I'd be delivering morphine to my best friend. How's it going, Time Tripper? It's funny. I think I look older. Okay, how the fuck do I go back it's in cool time, dude? Chloe uses natural medicine too. How the fuck do I go back in time? Nothing here. Fuck, that's so sad. Oh, fuck, that's so sad. Oh, god damn it, dude. We fucking. I got. I gave her the dussy in here the first time, dude. That was in here. I gotta find the photo, dude. This is where we bam clams the first time. A blue butterfly? I'm sure this is a total coincidence. At least we never had to hide from step douche. I guess we stopped growing up together. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm gonna cry. Fuck. I'm still overwhelmed by this new reality. And I feel so guilty for putting Chloe and her family through this. I could give Chloe the choice of keeping William alive, but that would be cruel. But then I see that they're a family again, and who am I to judge? Bro, you need to save her. I, I, never I don't heard care. Much about William's brother. Why can't William and William's brother die? Huh? Shoes. <laughs> Chloe always did love stomping around in her boots. God damn it, dude. Toys? I kind of want to open this and see what's in here. They bought crutches for Chloe, hoping she might walk again. Crutches never used. Too bad Joyce and William can't get any help from the Prescott Foundation. It's all about you, Arcadia Bay, isn't it? Okay, how do I save everything, dude? How do I fucking... I'll kill the mom. I'll kill the dad. I don't care. I need to fix this. The Speedwagon Foundation. That's funny. Where are the photos? They're drowning in debt. Just to take care of their daughter. Such bullshit. Heldishers no longer covers physical rehab? Fuck, man.
Why are you looking at my, uh, me all weird like you know Finally. I did? Finally. Uh, give me the blue pill. I'm sorry. I'm nosy, but not precise. Go ahead and plug it right in. It's so easy. And painless. Um, okay, but get ready to yell for your folks if I screw up. Oh, trust me. I will. Of course, my pain just keeps getting worse. But you caught me on a good day. Max, I'm so grateful that I'm even able to hang out with you. See, I'm getting mushy. I'm already high. <laughs> Is she killing herself? You're so adorable. Do you want anything else? Um, stop me if I'm being too emo. But can you grab one of the photo albums over there? I'd like to check out some old pictures of us when we were kids. Is she fucking Please. trying to kill herself? My what diary is like emo ground zero. Plus, Max Caulfield does not pass up a photo okay, with Okay, Jesus Chloe Christ, Christ, no spoilers. Ever. Where the fuck are her photo albums, dude? Oh my god, I made that mix for her when we were 12. Wait, where's the photo album? Oh, here it is. Chat, I'll just go back in time if she tries to kill herself with the morphine. Is that okay? <gasps> oh, fuck! Photo album! Oh, shit! Oh, it's time. Oh, oh it's my time. God. Look how little we are there. We look like toys. I remember that day by the lighthouse. My dad was pissed at us. He actually tried to give us a time out. And you laughed at him. <laughs> my dad would have banished me. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Yeah, turn the page, baby. I'm going back Whoa, in time. Awesome picture. We look so badass in our pirate gear. We should have taken over Arcadia Bay when we had the chance. There's still time for you. Oh man, there we are making pancakes. Oh dude. Oh, oh dude, I'm letting the dad us. die so hard. It's hard to believe my dad took that picture only five years ago. Literally seems like yesterday. I wish it was. Me too. This photo. Maybe. Let's I could. go. Let's go. I'm killing Willie. I'm killing wet ass Willie, dude. Listen, Max. My respiratory system is failing, and uh, and it's only getting worse. I've heard the doctors talking about it when they thought I was zonked out. So I know I'm just putting off the inevitable while my parents suffer along, and I will too. This isn't how I want things to end. What? What are you saying? She wants I'm euthanasia. Saying that being with you again has been so special. I just wanted to feel like when we were kids running around Arcadia Bay and everything was possible and you made me feel that way today. I want this time with you to be my last memory. Oh my God, this game fucking sucks. You dude. understand? Why did they make this game? Yes, I do. All you have to do is crank up the IV to 11. I fucking called it, dude. Wait, is there a way to... Okay, first of all, if I was if I was maintaining my moral consistency, I am a firm believer in in uh, voluntary active euthanasia. This would be a yes moment. But having the option of going back in time and having the option of going back in time and saving her life and killing her dad instead, and also the fact that I want to eat the dussy, I'm I'm gonna say no and then go back in time. Chloe, I, I really don't know if I can do this. 
I had another friend who wa wanted to end it all, and I did everything I could to try and save her life. How can I be responsible for ending yours? I mean, th there's got to be another way. Max, you were there for your friend, no matter what. Now I'm asking you to help. Alright, I'm gonna same kill way. her. Fuck it. I'm gonna kill her and I go want back in to time. Help you, Chloe, but I, I think my help is hurting. At least you have a choice. When you want to make a decision, you can just do okay, it. Okay, stop, 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 stop. Don't try to Look justify. I'll, ki I'll kill you. Stop. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. This everybody. is so much worse. Oh no. Oh no. I should For not. Once, I want to make my own choice. The most important one of my life. Fuck. I'll kill you. I'll Please. kill you. Okay. I will. I will. Fuck, 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 Help fuck, fuck. Max. This is so much worse. For her to like beg for her dignity. Okay. Done. Chloe. I'll just drift to sleep. Dreaming of us here together. Forever. Fuck! Oh no. Wait, your dad. Her dad is going to be like, what the fuck did you just do? We didn't want her to die. Thank you so much. We spent like 700 grand on I'm her. I'm so proud of you for And you just fucking dreams. killed her. Don't forget about me. Never. She didn't even I get to say goodbye much. to her family. Ha <laughs> ha. See you around. Sooner than you think. I would literally go to jail under this under these circumstances. Like if I didn't have the power of of going back in time. I just killed her. I'm sorry, William. Someday dad will get one of them newfangled computers. I hope the flash didn't scare you, Max. This is a keeper. Hello? Hey, honey. <laughs> what? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Aha! You can't hide from me forever. And no Chloe and Max wine tasting session. Dad. Don't blow it because tonight your mother promised to make us a What the fuck? She just surprise with chocolate cake for dessert. Max, you'll be here too, right? She's never leaving me. That makes all of us. It's always good to have the option of the photo. Why did you fucking burn it? Max, you are being so fucking strange. Like you're never gonna see us again. Chloe, I'm so sorry. I tried to make things different for you. I, I did try. I'm sorry. I don't know exactly what you're talking about, but come on. You have made things different, like my whole life. You're my best friend. I've got you and a great family. What's to be sorry for? We'll be best friends forever. And when we grow up, we're taking over the world. Listen, whatever happens, I want you to be strong. Even if you feel like I wasn't there for you. Because I will never abandon you, Chloe. I'll always have your back. Always. Bro, I just killed you, went back in life. Went back in time and killed your dad. Like, fuck you mean, dude.
How did her dad die? I'm so lost. Her dad is supposed to die. Her dad dies on that day. I went in time and saved his life. And then when I saved his life, Chloe got fucking paralyzed from the neck down. Yo, fuck William, dude. Bitch ass William, dude. get one kiss and now you're all over me? I'm just... I'm just... I'm so glad you're here. You sound high.
You won this battle, I'm Nix. Not God. You broke Outright up my family. By weird, champ. I salute you. David, I didn't try to hurt you. Ever. But I won't let anybody hurt Chloe. Too late, isn't it? You just better be damn careful with her. Don't you wander off into the dark. Now I'm scared of doing anything. David isn't any different from me when he's looking at those family photos. The fuck do you want, Warren? God, you're so fucking horny. Warren, get your fucking horny bullshit out of here. Hey, honey, I just got a weird text. My nosy daughter better stop watching others and look out for herself. This is kind of... Oh, I'm sorry. Some jackass in my class thought it'd be funny to send. It's not. I don't like strangers having my number. Okay, me neither. Sorry. I'm just being a dad. I know it's been a tough week for you. Hey, girlfriend, let me know when you want to come by my room. I'll give you a fashion makeover. Right in the eye of the storm. I miss you and my bunny. In a van by a sketchy meth head. Whales are like beached angels. What is going on here? Ouch. Do not be here when I get back from work. Holy shit. That's real aggro. To think this all started with my vision of a tornado. Joyce must be so upset. Are you helping anybody, Max? It looks like David finished his car repairs. Maybe there's some new clues around. I promise I'll help Miss Grant next time. If there is one. Oh, meow, Miss Grant. Twist that knife. At least he has one weird fan. Liptard metrosexual. <laughs> Wish I had surveillance footage of that conversation. Surveillance cameras at Pan Estates? David must be working for the Prescotts, too. Damn. There's more to David Madsen than meets the eye. He should finish this letter to Joyce. I don't know, I'm not going to explain to myself or why I act the way I do sometimes. I know that nobody has ever understood me the way you do. I would never do anything to hurt you or Chloe. 
there are dark things happening in Arcadia Bay. I've never told you. You are my wife and partner, and I know we should have no secrets. I intended to tell you everything, but I just wanted more proof. Instead, a student almost committed suicide on my watch, and you kicked me out of my favorite home, and my stepdaughter hates me. Please let me. Damn, I feel kind of bad now. Fuck. Oh, jeez. David is packing up wedding stuff, too. Oh, that makes me sad. It was so incredible to see William again. I wish Chloe could, too. I just came here to say life is strange. More like you're strange. Get toasted, you libtard. <laughs> uh, good one, chat. Oh, he left all of his guns, though. Either Chloe stole another gun, or David is out there armed. Either Chloe stole another gun, or David is out there armed. So David is just going to become the school shooter. What the hell did David do for Nathan? And what did his dad do for David? Suck Nathan off, dude. Hey. David's finna be a good guy with a gun, you know what I'm saying? I wonder saying? if David is going to the party. Oh my god, is he gonna go to the party and be a good guy with a gun? To all the bad guys? With no guns? Whoa, that is a serious padlock on that locker. Hey David, whatcha hiding? Wait, I know what the password is. I knew that number would be important. Holy shit. Oh, maps, notes, coordinates, photos of Kate, Nathan. Oh, yes. What the fuck? What the fuck? Score. Back to Chloe now. Oh, look at the baby blue jay eggs in the nest. I, I better move his plank if I want to take the shot. Excuse me, just one picture, please. Click, another photo from my Arcadia Bay wildlife series. Oh, thank you. Sleep tight, my eggy eggs. So glad that I scared their mother away. That was a pretty tight move on my behalf, huh, guys? Glad I did that. It's cool because now I get to take a photo of it. So that's fine. There's like It's amazing how much drug looks like David already booked a room. Looks like they're back on the road to Paris. Fuck you mean, William is dead, dude.
Did I actually cause that clock to stop? Oh, there's a ladybug stuck in the dials. Yo, Chloe! Are you ready yet? I have to get back to my dorm. Are we happy? Very happy. I hit the secret file jackpot. Kate, Nathan, and Rachel. Plus some location coordinates. David is like a one-man surveillance army. Now let's get the hell out of here before we get busted. But I absolutely have to go see Kate in the hospital right now. I want to find out how she's doing. Are we both gonna die now? In a car crash? This is definitely Kate's floor. The hospitals always freak me out. I, I hear you. But imagine how Kate feels. I'm so glad I, I get to see her again. I hope it's not too weird for her. No, she'll be stoked to see you. Who wouldn't be? This be it. I'm a little nervous. Just go in there and be your friend. I'll wait out here so you can chill by yourselves. I was a total dick for blowing a fuse when you answered Kate's call the other day. Good thing you ignored me. I had no idea what shit she was going through. And you saved her. Like me. I'm sorry. Bro, you don't even know how I saved you, okay? Thanks, Chloe. You don't want to know. Don't be sorry. We're all on the same team. Team Max. Let Kate know we're gonna string Nathan up by his balls then. Oh yes, <laughs> I'm on it. The shit I had to do? Bro, she always looks like shit. Max. Oh, Kate. I thought I'd never see you again. I feel so ridiculous. I'm so sorry. Kate, listen to me. You have nothing to be sorry about. Other people do. You do not know how happy I am to see you. You look awesome. Is it a stupid question if I ask how you're doing? Now that you're here, I'm doing even better. I'm so grateful to you for coming up to the roof to talk me down. Max, I felt so lost and alone. When I saw how much you cared, how hard you were trying, you made me realize I wasn't alone. Thank you. Kate, there are so many people who love you and want to help you. I know. You should see all the letters and postcards. I gave most of the flowers to other patients here because they need them more than me. I'm keeping Aww. the balloons, though. One of the nurses gave me some pen and paper so I could do some drawings. I love your illustrations. They got kind of dark there for a while. But I have an idea for a new children's book about bullying. I was so what do? photographs in there too. I hope that's a subtle hint that you'll let me take the photographs for the book. Was that subtle? You better take the pictures, Max. I'm going to be here for another day until my family comes out to visit. How are they treating you? Like they need to protect me forever. They're so upset, and I know they feel guilty even though they didn't do anything. I was surprised how many students from Blackwell wrote me. Daniel, Mr. Jefferson, even Victoria wrote me a very sweet note. And I believe she was being real. Me too. I'm glad you believe Oh my god, I'm just lying I'm to her on now. It, Max. I just Pray I can get this drawing right. Good one, Hassan Piker of the Young Turks. <laughs> yeah. 
She she debated Orb Mother as Dave Rubin, and now she's in recovery mode from all the high level ideas. I don't think get well is quite apropos. Those are nice flowers. And from Taylor? Wow, props to her. <sighs> if this gets Kate through the night, so be it. Wow, she's falsifying the Christian God right now, as we speak. That is so sweet. Even Victoria signed. But not Nathan. Someone needs to debate her right now. Someone needs to debate her right now to tell her that believing in uh, Jesus Christ and Christianity to get her through these like troubled times is actually not the right thing to do. And what she needs to do is use logic and reasoning. I'm not God. I don't care if you just recovered from uh, suicide. Actually, as a matter of fact, you need you need to be an atheist right now. Just fucking rip the Jesus photo. Yeah. Hey, have you thought about... Hey, have you thought about uh, grounding your moral axioms? That would help you Principal try to Wells kill yourself to next time. Principal Wells knows when he wants to. Good to see that I'm Kate is still God. working on her book report. Oh, I love Kate's happy rainbow flock. Um... Wait, what was I going to do? I was going to do something. Oh, I was going to go back in time and... And see if I can talk about the Nathan Prescott. Kate, it is so good to hang out with you again. Max, I owe you so much. And I can tell you want to talk to me about something. I saw Victoria's letter. How does that make you feel? Max, I know Victoria can be a, uh, not nice, but I do believe in forgiveness and redemption. I might be naive, but I feel her struggle. I wasn't so nice to her this week either when I took a picture of her covered in paint. Uh, it was not a proud moment. We all have our moments. Why do you think she acts so mean? She's insecure. If you're comfortable with yourself, you don't need to act superior. Victoria doesn't look like she has much to be insecure about. If anybody could make Victoria see the light, it would be Kate Marsh. No, I think it will take more than that, Max. I want you to know I'm this close to getting all the info I need about Nathan. Nathan Prescott has to pay for what he did. And we have to stop him from hurting anybody else. Well, I did get his ass suspended, so that might be a start. You did? Oh, right on, Max. I love how fearless you are. So what is going on with him now? Oh, what happened? I thought we were forgiving and forgetting. I think his family is totally protecting him. Or worse. I never say this about people, but Max, there's something evil about the Prescotts. Oh, okay. I guess they have something I guess to do with death. We're going to stop him. What happened? I, I thought just have to I find thought you Nathan's didn't want uh, revenge. I thought get it was inside and get the clues I need. Max, please let me help. I can get the number and I'll text it to you. Okay? Of wow. course, Kate. I can't do this without you. Now it's time for Nathan to watch out for us. I just had a seizure because of your flickering I lights. always want to talk to you. Yeah, okay. We missed our tea session this week. That was so not cool. We need to plan, like, a tea shop tour of Portland. 
Oh, yes. And you could bring Warren along, too. Her moral axioms are, her moral system is inconsistent. Disgust. What do you think of uh, Warren? Oh, smart and silly. He's got such a good heart. And he's a cutie pie. You know he likes you. I'm going to the drive-in with him, so <laughs> we'll see. With everything that's going on, a, a date seems weird. No, you deserve that. Kate Marsh, matchmaker. I'm glad somebody is looking out for my love life. Even angels need angels, Max. I have to get back to our uh, mission. You don't know how much it means to see you again. I do. That's why I love you, Max. Thanks for taking care of my bunny. Tell Alice I'll see her soon. Damn, Justin Bieber just tweeted at Donald Trump and was like, can you get the kids out of the cages? Canadians are good. Junior Pepega, you are posting so much straw man cringe. Can one of the mods ban Junior Pepega? He's annoying me. Thanks. Well, how is she? She's still Kate Marsh. Thank you, Kuro. Thank God. I'm glad we came to see her. Thanks for coming with me. Now let's go pay a visit to Nathan Prescott. That little prick is not going to be going to see us. Let's go kill us. Nathan Prescott for real, though. I can't believe that teacher hasn't fucked one student yet. Hey, Max. How you doing? Oh, hi, Mr. Jefferson. I'm okay. Um, and this is my friend, Chloe. Yeah. Chloe? Why isn't somebody as cool as you going to Blackwell? Oh, oh my god, he's trying school. to get that dussy. That's a long story. Yo, that's mine, bro. Yeah, Chill. Here. I can imagine. Max, are you sure that you're all right? Listen, Mr. It's Jackson, I'll suck you off right now, being okay? On campus, like everything's normal. I know, lame as it sounds, life has to go on. I think there's too much going on in my life. On that note, Blackwell duty calls. Remember, I'm going to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes contest tonight at the party. So I hope you'll be there to celebrate, even though I'm sorry you didn't enter a photo. I understand your reasons. You can't force an artist to work. I feel like a total loser, but it's been a hard week to focus. No pun intended. I'm proud of you for caring so much about a troubled friend. And I take hope in the fact that you have plenty of time to find your way. Just get in the habit of putting your work out there. Thanks, Mr. Jefferson. I'll definitely be there tonight. Me too. I'll be Max's date. You better dance with us at least once. Oh shit, we're about to, to get a... me dance. Plus, you don't want to watch I'm the old Chad. To keep up with Chad, the I'm dance. fucking busting. Be seeing you. Yes, you will. Oh shit. Hot we're gonna have a teacher. threesome. Gross. You are out of control. Not yet. Just wait until the rager tonight. <sighs> Shut oh, up. Shit. Don't be jealous because Mark Jefferson thinks I'm cool. I am so ignoring you. <laughs> Fine. Even fishes Since up. I'm here, I'll see if I can get some dirt from Justin. I haven't talked to him in a while. Now that is a great plan. Let's see if I can find out where Nathan is. Jefferson still sus as shit. But hey, guess what? We're gonna suck him dry tonight, okay? seen you because you're way too cool for us now Chloe way too much to 
That's so ironic that Warren asked. Hey, Brooke, how are you? I'm here Part as your usual. Hair on the right side, By the your way, head shows you're more feminine and less of a leader. Yeah, down. Sure. Are you okay? I need to find Nathan. Have you seen him around? Ask Warren. I mean, you're going to the movies with him and everything. Come on, Brooke. Don't be that way. Nathan was suspended. Oh, but damn. Brooke is. He should still be on campus. Warren's not good enough for you? Okay. I saw Nathan pissed and walking off campus earlier. Good luck getting that date, Max. Damn, bitch. Don't be so fucking jelly, okay? God damn. I might feel better taking your drone for a quick flight. Miss Grant finally gave up and let me fly her again. But you're going to the drive-in with Warren, so you don't have time to fly my drone. Oh my god. Really? I can't fly your drone because I'm going to see ape movies with Warren? You are perceptive, Max. Now, excuse me. My drone needs me. Good. Listen, I wasn't Nathan even gonna... Not around. I wasn't even gonna I fuck go Warren, to but now... Max Just to spite you, I'm gonna suck him off hey, good Brooke, too. How are you? I'm here. I need to find. Ask Warren. Come on, bro. Warren's not. Wait, what? I thought there was a. I, I can't get my limited brain around that eclipse and the beached whales. I was hoping the science department had some ideas. Warren and I are supposed to compare notes and theories this weekend. Oh, he asked you? You know, science geeks stick together. But honestly, neither of us can explain this phenomenon. It's pretty scary. I have to go. Talk later, Brooke. Back again, Brooke. Are you sure you're all right? I might feel better. Miss Grant finally gave up and left. Really? You are per. Okay, she won't let me get the drone. Oh my god, someone said the eclipse made me think of the first season of I had to clear away another batch of dead birds today. Sad. Makes me mad. Climate change. How are you doing, Max? Been a tough week. I know. Yes, it has, Samuel. How are you? Hero's first season was sad and confused, all right. like everybody else in Arcadia Bay. You look like you have a lot of questions, too. Bro, this guy definitely fucks children. I definitely have questions about what's happening to the animals in Arcadia Bay. Oh, many do. These poor creatures have no choice in what happens to them. What do you think about all those dying birds? Samuel had to bury dozens near the Tabanga. Is that cool with the Tabanga? We'll find out if the souls of the bird move on. Not that we can prove it. It's so ominous. Unless it's fate, then it doesn't matter. How can anybody explain all those poor Why is she asking whales? him this shit? My dad was a fisherman, and he'd take me out to hear the whales sing. Now they... they just cry. Do you think this is some kind of eco-disaster, or...? I think it's more than that. Somebody is causing all this to happen. You think so, Samuel? You and Arcadia Bay are connected by... Time and tide. So, next time I have a question, I'm coming to you. What the fuck? Bro, he knows, dude. Oh, I'm glad to see your squirrels are still healthy and happy on the campus. How Me does he too. know? If something happened to them, oh. Not as long as you're here to take care of them, Samuel. The only thing that calms them is food. <laughs> Lots of food. Which reminds me th that I have to feed them now. How the fuck does he know? He's a faith leader. Oh, yeah. 
reel my ass. I think everything. Hi, Miss Grant. Max, you always show up when I'm talking about you. And I swear, it's not about that petition you didn't sign. Yeah, damn, bitch. Let go of it, the petition, okay? I got the fucking dude fired and ruined his life. What do you want from me? I Fuck. was hoping you could explain some of these crazy things happening in Arcadia Bay. If I could, I'd be collecting my Nobel Prize in science today. I haven't been we able to it. wrap my mind around that eclipse, much less the snow in Wales. It's just like one fucking element of the... I explore everything, there and then I, I forget one thing. There must be a scientific thing. explanation, right? When my friends at NASA tell me they can't explain a solar eclipse without a single theory wow, as to how or why... Wow, name drop in NASA. Maybe it's time to get worried. Like they oh, are. sick. I am worried about reality. I feel like sick. it's changing. Oh yeah, oh right sick, dude. Oh, you, you got friends you in NASA. Samuel we both. got, it. we get it. We were talking about that before you came over. Our planet is changing, but it's not mystic. It's erosion. Sick flex, dude. So, you don't think this could be some kind of prophecy or something, Max? You know how fascinated I am by Arcadia Bay legends. But I haven't found any apocalyptic signs yet. Unless you count those end of the world posters. Unless you know something I don't. Oh my gosh, she knows too. I wonder if the Tabanga knows more than anybody here. Oh Max, nobody even knows who brought the Tabanga here. It was likely stolen from the South Pacific by local fishermen. But I know what you're saying. There's a lot of energy here. She's such a libtard. Classic libtard professor, dude. I was looking for Prescott, dude. and I thought he might be in your class. Mr. Prescott has no class at all after his suspension. I didn't think you were friends. Hell no. Sorry, Miss Grant. You're an adult. You can swear, damn it. And I'm glad you did. So you haven't seen Nathan at all? Let's just say I try not to, Max. But see? I did catch him storming off campus. See, That's lip dart professors believing in fucking climate You're change. You're not the best student here, but you, you might be the wisest. Talk about NASA. Talk about fucking uh, globe, like globe conspiracies, and then fucking letting kids say hell no instead of H E double hockey sticks. Disgusting. I don't think surveillance would have helped, Kate Marsh. Who needs surveillance when we have Maxine Caulfield? You did a wonderful thing. And now we have to make sure Kate gets the help she needs. Do you need to talk to a counselor? Freaking globe tards, yeah. Blackwell Academy needs the help. There's something terrible going on here. You see it, right? This week hasn't been Blackwell's finest hour. But me and some faculty members won't rest until all the students here feel safe, not bullied. Kate was drugged at the Vortex Club party and bullied by them until she ended up on the roof. How do you stop that? Shut down that damn Vortex Club for a start. I don't See? mean to get riled up, but that party should have been postponed. It's extremely tasteless given what happened with Kate. See, liberal liberal professors trying to end children from having fun. Disgusting. Do the Prescotts have anything to do with the Vortex Club? I mean, they don't get all their money from car washes. No, they don't. But membership has its privileges, especially when your father is Blackwell's biggest sponsor. If only the Dobre brothers it's were at this school, they could have stopped no the bullying. Here. I You're stole right. that from the. I stole that from I Meg Pease. I just wish this could be the school that I dreamed about. That was a good joke, Meg Pease. I, I hear you, Max. I love seeing you and Warren and all my students at your best here. But you're all too young to be so cynical. Going on the wolf, but you, you can stop that. Me hope. I'm sorry, Miss Grant. The wolf. I, I have to get going. I I'll see you later. It's always good talking to you, Max. It's changing. Yeah. As a scientist, I'm fascinated. As Michelle Grant. I'm very worried. Arcadia Bay is scared too. Look at the weather. Get that food in your belly. Not to mention poor Kate Marsh. We all need to look out for each other these days. What the fuck is up with these birds, dude? 
Is that even birds? Is that how birds operate? That's sus as fuck. Good thing I didn't let Chloe take that money from Principal Wells. <laughs> what is this nine gag shit, dude? <laughs> Alyssa, why you play hard to get when you already hard to want? What the fuck is this meme, dude? Hey, Daniel. Oh my God! Oh my God! Look at Daniel's shirt. Are you all right? Hola, Max. I just figured out that my photos basically suck only poc in the game by the ice. way look at his shirt you tip 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 my lady oh no oh look at his fucking shirt oh no dude oh no take different photos Maybe for you him you should try different subjects something more like your portraits that makes sense but not if I can't choose the subjects in class. If only I could draw my photographs. I think I'll just sit here bummed out, thanks. Bro. What? Hey, Daniel. Hola, Max. Daniel, your drawings are your photographs. So draw your photos with your eyes and make the camera your lens pen. Lens pen? Oh, I dig that, Max. That could work for me. <sighs> I do feel better now. I'm almost certain you that they got a white guy to do it, like a Hispanic accent. Like, this is not even... Oh, uh, I will do this for you. They were just like, all right, we got to put some fucking brown people in this game, dude. Come on. Like, these Americans, they, what do they got? What do they got, Mexicans or something? All right, cool. Let's write in a Mexican character. Are you going to the end of the world party tonight? It will be if I go, man. People here push me into lockers, not dance floors. That's exactly why you should go. Oh no, party. I bet he's gonna get killed. We now. have to stand up to these Blackwell bullies for Kate. I shouldn't have done that. You won't be alone, Daniel. I shouldn't have done Not that, with right? You direct me up, Max. Oh, damn it! I will go to the party like it is the end of the world. Okay, maybe I won't go, but no, I won't do that. But I'll go. By the way, have you seen Nathan Prescott? Oh, I heard a rumor he's actually suspended. Yeah, but. He's still got to be on campus. That explains why he looked so pissed off when I saw him leaving campus a few moments ago. Have you talked to anybody about what happened with Kate? I don't talk to anyone, Max. But I did actually have a nice talk with Brooke. She couldn't stop talking about how brave you were on that roof. I don't think doing the right thing is brave, but I appreciate what she means. The most important thing is that Kate gets better and gets justice. I hear that, Max. She's the sweetest, most genuine person I've ever met. I bet this guy I now believes that there should be a white ethno holes, state. But don't fuck with Kate. I like this revolutionary Daniel DaCosta. Only if I can start the revolution from my sketchbook, Max. Let's talk later. Okay, Daniel? Like, I bet this guy got bullied into being fucking 4chan. Coast is clear. It would be so cool if you and me were going to school here together. But now you can have Mr. Jefferson all to yourself. Ah, oh, you suck. Now let's get into Blackwell Ninja mode. It's so lame, they don't have co-ed dorms here. Yes, because I want Nathan Prescott in the room next door. Good point. 
Wait here. Give me the signal if Nathan or anybody shows up. I won't let you down, Batmax. Now I just have to find Nathan's room. Evan. Of course. That's why no shits were given. Evan rolls. Apparently Logan missed this poster. Oh, why, hello, Trevor. And Dana. They had a Latino guy voice other characters, but Daniel was voiced by some white guy in the This can only be Nathan's room. Oh, you Bigfoots. Looks like one of the jocks did care about Kate. Poor Warren. This is the work of Nathan. He's so lucky I'm a pacifist. Well, TOS. That's hate speech, dude. Hello, Warren's room. Hawking and him make a good team. I can have a little fun with Warren for a change. I mean, he's the one who wants to go Abe. And sometimes you have to take a chance and see what happens. Excuse me. Are you made of copper and tellurium because you're cute? I hope Warren doesn't think that's too dorky. Damn, I'm trying to I mean, fuck Warren like too. Isn't. Bro, nobody He'll laugh, I will right? I will fucking I will fuck everybody in this game, okay? Ugh, skunk weed and video games. I sense Hayden is near. I just fucked that entire relationship up for Warren and the and the Asian chick. That was... Holy shit, look at this kid's dick. Oh, now I need to find Nathan's phone. Or anything with... That is so Chloe. Now that David's not here, I need Chloe to step up and stop acting out so much. But I won't let that happen to you. If you're getting mixed up in illegal crap like breaking it, breaking in the black well or not, I know it happens, so don't bother to defend or explain. And I hoped you would get her back on the right track, but it looks like she's getting stuck again. You could be such a good influence on her. Cute and ironic. I can't believe Nathan still has it around. That monochrome camera is brand new and costs about six grand. Bastard. I thought Victoria had the photo bling, but once again, the Prescott's rule. I don't think this prescription has helped Nathan. My boys. Filthy. I'd cry too if I had him for a father and had to wear that suit. Let's see what Nathan hides in here. Holy shit. That's the gun Nathan used on Chloe. Gift from Nathan Prescott, all American teen. 
That looks like a totally fun show. Even Nathan has a light side. My man is horned up, just like I am. Yes, I would be cool with having this high-tech projector. Damn, Nathan. That's a nice shot. It's so damn creepy, but the guy has his own style. I don't think one book can guide the Prescotts. Whale songs? Maybe this is the only soothing thing Nathan ever hears. Why is he listening to whale songs? That must be the lamp Chloe broke when Nathan drugged her. These films all have a dark pattern. Nathan likes his tortured subjects way too much. Oh man, that dickhead stole one of my selfies. Come on, Max. You're in the belly of the beast. Nathan is way into this party. Bad sign. Oh, bastard. Now I remember why I hate you. Oh, man. Sean Prescott might be Nathan's real problem. Your mother wants Dr. Bill to come out after this book tour, but now it's sick. Panacea's being developed. I know Prescott's a burden. I'll guide you in the room step by step as by my father. Don't worry about Blackwell. This shit old town's gonna get an enema along with the fresh brand. Too bad Nathan isn't more like his sister. She sounds awesome. And far away. I bragged to all my co-workers in the Peace Corps. You've been in trouble, father's been on your ass. Yes, Nathan sure needs diet pills. This is strong stuff. Wow. Kiss ass much, Principal Wells. Your name and record speaks for itself. What the fuck? What a bitch. Okay, where the fuck is his phone? I don't think this prescription has helped, Nathan. What the hell are all those marks on the floor? Move the couch, dummy. Let's find out what you're hiding. Oh yes, little phone. You are mine now. Now it? I thought Victoria had the photo bling, but cool. Now it's opened. You're finally back. I got worried. So what did you find? His room was clean and creepy. Check this out. Oh, fuck. I forgot to Boom, fucking move Nathan. the couch. We got you by the balls, fucker. What are you doing in my dorm? You're such a nosy bitch, Max. Stop right there, Nathan. Make me, ho. <clears throat> Max, I got this. Get the fuck out of my face. <clears throat> nice. Uh, oh, dude, Warren. You are so fucking dead. Uh, Holy get shit. Get off me, bro. Uh, get off me, bro. Beat his fucking ass, dude. Stay out of it. Let him beat his ass. You like to hurt people, huh? Like Max? Like Kate? Like me? Yeah, huh? beat his Feel fucking ass. Kill him! Fucking kill him, dude! Kill him! Get off me! Please! Please stop! 
up. Yeah, bitch. Yeah, what's up? Oh, you like that? He's down. Use the gun. Hey, Use the gun on him. Pick on. the gun up and kill him. Stop. <laughs> Sorry. Yes, we have to go. Who's the bitch now? Chloe. Oh! Oh, no, 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 no. Damn, Warren went full alpha on Nathan. And it was good. But scary. Shit, yeah, I'm not rewinding that Shit, at all. Man. Bitch. Should have spat on him like Damn. Before you walked out. That was intense. Out. Warren. Uh, Thank you so much. For what? For beating the shit out of Nathan Prescott? Oh, fuck Dude, yeah. You rule. I don't know. I kind of went crazy there. Like Nathan. You're not anything like him. Good to know. So where are you going? There is no tolerant I left, I better stick Chad. with you guys. Just in case you need me to get my Hulk on again. Or should I call the cops on Nathan? No police. Not yet. Uh, so maybe you better... Um, Warren, me and Max have to do this on our own. No offense. It's cool. Whatever I can do to help. What you can do is find out anything you can about Nathan's father. I'm on it. Between the snow and eclipse, I'm assuming the apocalypse is around the corner. And thank you. Seriously. I'll call you later. You better. I'm feeling pretty alpha now. Yes, you are. He went ape mode, dude. Ape gang. He went ape on him. Man, that guy is so fucking in love with you. I know. He really did give a serious beat down to Nathan. It was a little scary to watch him do that. Now let's make a date with Frank. Scary. Will he even answer you? More like fucking hot, dude. Frank always answers when he wants money. Hell yeah. Like I said, Frank wants to see me right now. Let's not keep him waiting. <sighs> Fuck yeah, dude. I'm not God. By the way, if you guys like this commentary and then my gameplay, please subscribe. You can do it for free if you have a Twitch Prime account. How do I have a Twitch Prime account? Well, you have an Amazon account, Amazon Prime account that you connect to your Twitch account. So. Instead of saying no, how about you fucking God. subscribe, you sons of bitches? I hate seeing those poor whales like that. Me too. I just think of their families Excuse in the ocean. Me. Thank you, legendary ex hobo. I'm out of control. I apologize for that. Well, that asshole is going to help us find Rachel. Or what? You'll actually shoot him? Chloe, do not count on my rewind. Seriously. I'm Thank you, Abed not. Nadir. Obviously, I'm not counting on you. That's why I have a gun. And I might even save you someday. About time. I am so going to hit you. There's no way we Thank could have lost this. Thank you, Katie. This is for gifting a tier one sub to Kazafir. I'm looking forward to the day when we can just go on a road trip to Portland. Fuck yeah. You, me, and Rachel. Absolutely. So let's play this cool, okay? Just talk to Frank so we can Kimbo. get that code for the book guns. from him. That's all. Got it. No dicking around. Let's roll. Frank doesn't need tinted windows when they're this dirty. Can't see inside with this shit blocking the view. Oh, fresh meat. So Pompadour must be okay. Good doggy. Take the trash out sometime, dude.
This is where Frank ponders his existence and gets drunk. I feel like Frank has a good, good life. Like all jokes aside. Just like kind of lives on the beach with his RV. Oh, look, the Wonder Twins. What's up, Frank and Beans? Come alone. It's a stick She's up, a bitch. Yeah, we're bodyguard. So let's get to business. Where's my fucking money? I... I don't have the money. Yet. Oh, really? Then why did you text me that you did? Because I wanted to tell you in person. Oh, I'm truly touched, Chloe. Now why are you losers really here? We just want to ask you some questions. You have some mm. serious lady balls. <laughs> no. Jesus, okay, okay. But I'm not getting you high. Frank, we're not here to get high. He seems like No, you don't look like the type. Not like Chloe here. So what do you hardy boys want? He keeps misgendering. Just the names of some of your clients. Oh, is that all? Oh, well, why didn't you just tell me? How about I just give you the keys to my RV while I'm at it? You already did. Listen, Frank, I'm sorry to be such a nuisance, but this is important. Yeah, yeah, everything's important these days. But I can tell you're not bullshitting me. There's no time for that, Frank. I, I just need a little bit of information. Yeah, yeah, well, it always starts with just a little. And Chloe here knows all about that, don't you? Come on, Frank, this isn't about Bro, me now. Bro, you literally yeah, are... right, okay. Both of you are giving You're literally me talking about giving no drugs deal. to children. What the Frank? fuck? We didn't come here to fight. This is so much bigger than it's us. Because, like, yeah, it starts Wait, you, a little. Isn't that peace? right, Chloe? Like, After I gave you, you a little bit of meth. you gun at me and then pulled the trigger. I was helping Chloe after you threatened to cut her. Remember? You know, you're lucky all I brought was a knife. Otherwise, you and your girlfriend wouldn't even be bothering me. You really think you're tough shit, girly. I just... I didn't know what I was doing. Dude, get off her ass. She was protecting me. You've got a knife and God knows what else. Are you really afraid of Max here? I'm not afraid of anybody except my maker. And you little bitches think oh, he's you a can God -fearing man. Me? Why, because I'm trailer trash? You're Blackwell trash. And it's time to take you out. Calm down, Frank. Let's just talk. Don't you ever tell me what to do. Get it, bitch? Get it? Step the fuck back now! <laughs> Pompadou! No. No! You fucking killed my dog! Oh my god! No! Not the dog! We gotta rewind. Why can't I rewind? Validity! <laughs> I need to rewind. Oh no! Chloe. I just shot a man and his dog. I killed Frank Bowers. You saved my life, Chloe. It, it, it was self-defense for both of us. Max? Frank is really dead. I know, but we can't stop now. Okay, I gotta we go back. We have to find that code. Okay, Before we gotta go back. Pops, come. We gotta go back. Why is rewinding not working? That's it. Let's get out of here. Sorry, Frank. I'm sorry. Wait, now I don't... Jesus. Chloe actually killed Frank. She'll never forgive herself or forget this. Give me the fucking code. And only I can change it. No, give me the fucking code so I can rewind it. Oh 
Fresh meat. So Pompadour must be okay. Good doggy. More like dead doggy. Behold, Frank's beer garden. It blows my mind that I was just here with Good thing there are no actual cops around to bust us. Listen, Chloe. I can tell you for a fact that this will not go well. Max, I should have known you would be kind and rewind. So tell me exactly what I need to do here. Okay, this is fucked. I don't know. I don't know if we should get rid of the gun because I feel like... I feel like... I feel like the dog's gonna kill us, you know what I mean? I'm just gonna say watch your mouth. Please watch your mouth. You have no social skills here and you will piss off Frank immediately. You kind of love this, don't you? Fine, I'll try being like you for a change. Or how you used to be. Wait, what happened? Wait, what? I don't know what, what they said. Close the door, no fight, no weapon? What the fuck? Frank, uh, your dog is kind of scary. Could you please close the RV door? You aim your gun at me, but you're scared of my dog? That figures. All right, now we can kill Frank. Okay, there, you're safe. Now, what do you want? Just the names of some of your clients. Oh, is that all? Oh, well, why didn't you just tell me? How about I just give you the keys to my RV while I'm at it? Listen, Frank. I'm sorry to be such a nuisance, but this is important. Yeah, yeah, everything's important these days. But I can tell you're not bullshitting me. There's no time for that, Frank. I, I just need a little bit of information. Yeah, yeah, well, it always starts with just a little. And Chloe here knows all about that, don't you? Come on, Frank, this isn't about me now. Yeah, right, okay. Both of you are giving me a headache. No deal. Frank, we didn't come here to fight. This is so much bigger than us. What, you, you come in peace? After you aimed a fucking gun at me and then pulled the trigger. To be honest, Frank, you scared me. You held a knife on my friend. I didn't want to pull the trigger. I could tell by the way you held that pop gun with both hands like it was a magnum. Or maybe I shouldn't have brought that knife to a gunfight. I only want to shoot with my camera. I swear. Ask Chloe. Look, Frank, Max doesn't need a gun anyway. So are we cool? Please? Okay. We're cool for now. But my dog isn't. And if you try any shit, he will bite your head off. He's done it before. Well, you close the We're door, idiot. We're only here to talk. I wouldn't mess with your dog. Shit, you wouldn't have time. You like dogs? Of course I do. I heard you even rescued a bunch of fight dogs. That's amazing. No, all right, it was just the right thing to do. I couldn't stand to see those poor animals treated like, like slaves. That's how I came to own Pompadou. That's Aww. very cool, Frank. Your dog is lucky you came along. Maybe we can focus on rescuing Rachel now? Rachel? Is that why you're really here? Yes, we're so close to finding her now, Frank. We need I rescued all fish. the help we can get now, especially from you. I rescued fish, but sometimes I wonder if he rescued me.
You and Chloe do not know Rachel like I did. Look at him and I getting up. Look at him getting up immediately as soon as I start talking about it. Why don't you just go play in your clubhouse? Hi. Hold on one second, guys. But I bet he's a meat eater, so he's inconsistent. Debate Frank. Rachel said she gave you one of her favorite photos. That proves how much she cares. And you care. That's why you have to help. How the hell did you know about that photo? That's my favorite picture of her. I can look at it anytime and she'll always be there for me. I can't stand not knowing where she is. Not hearing her voice or her laugh anymore. We can change all that. It's up to you. Help us find her, Frank. Please. We really need your client list. Well, if there's a chance in hell, you two dorks can find Rachel. Yeah, I'll take it. My dog isn't barking at you, so I guess that's a good sign. We love dogs here. Literally rewinded. If only Frank died, I probably wouldn't have rewinded. Thank you. Yeah, thanks, Frank. Seriously. It's hard to take you characters seriously, but I want to. Good luck. Fish, we saved Pompadou. We saved Pompadou, fish. That was cool Frank gave up the code to help us. Rachel must have seen something good in him. This beach scene sucked, by the way. There was no sex on this beach scene. Fish is a fighting dog, too, okay? Chloe, are you okay? I'm glad things worked out okay with Frank. It's nice to have one less enemy in Arcadia Bay. Amen to that. Better focus on this board and start tying these clues together. Man, my man's still trying to fucking sell drugs, dude. What? I didn't... It's the fish story is a long one. I'll tell you guys at some point. Okay, it's not even a game break for the fish story, but 
What time is it? It's 11. I've been streaming since like 6. No, not only will I not tell you guys the fish story, but I'm actually going to... I'm actually going to... Um, you have to stream till 1 a.m. No, I'm actually going to go... Okay. I'll tell you guys the fish story as a last story, but then I got to go... Okay. All right. The fish story is not even that complicated, okay? So uh, it's not even that crazy. So here's what happened. Um, I always wanted to have a dog when I was younger. And my dad always lied to me and said that he was allergic to dogs so we can never have one. Turns out that was a lie. I only find that, found that out after I had fish. And um, I told my friends and their dads that, uh, not their dads, but like my, I told my friends that I wanted a dog. And one of their dads was in Orange County. Uh, one of their dads was in Orange County at a tire shop. And it turns out, Um, turns out there was a dog. It was a little pupper. Apparently a guy walked into the tire shop in Orange County and said, Hey, told the story on the scuff podcast. Did I, I don't remember, but, um, some guy walks into, walks into a tire shop in Orange County says, Hey, I have to, uh, I have to uh, take this call. Can you take care of this dog? The dog is fish. The guy is debating him. He never comes back. So my friend's dad is there. He picks up this pupper and he hits me up and says, hey, I heard you want a dog. It's a Rottweiler. And I didn't even know what the dog looked like. I was just like, yeah, I want a pupper. I want it. Um, yeah, I've always wanted a dog. And then uh, they brought fish to me. And that's it. The rest is history. That was like fucking almost six years ago now. Narrow goes, rejects always got to stick together. He is a, he is not a Rottweiler. He is a pit bull. I didn't know. But also you saved him because no shelter would have taken him in. Well, I mean, yeah, he's a pit bull. So. That's it. That's the story. It's not really a long story. Okay. Started stream late. Took three hours to finish playing Live is Strange. Hassan hates us. Okay, guys. I don't hate you guys, but we... I just I'm gonna hang out with Will. So that's why I'm I'm leaving. Okay? It's for a good cause. Yeah, I had to do politics, chat. I'm sorry. Uh, Raj wants me to go on the Raj show tomorrow, but I'm afraid I'm not going to be able to do that. Um, time for a song, gay sex? No, we're going out. But you killed Will to save Chloe. What the fuck? I'm not going to do the Raw show, but I will be doing my uh, show.
at some point. All right. I love you all. And let's see. Literally you, by the way. Gamer who skipped. Okay, chill. Okay, dude. Here, let's raid. Discord.gg slash son, of course. Don't forget. You know what? Let's raid Novaru. All right, for once. Let's raid a let's raid a woman for once, you know? A female. All right, good night, guys.